Hi and welcome back to our Dreamweaver tutorial. In the last video we began the process of setting up our banner slider for our website and we're going to continue that but before we do that I wanted to talk for just a moment about the Adobe Browser Lab tool. Now a few videos ago we talked about um, the importance of previewing your website in, an, in the actual browser um, that somebody would be using and the importance also of having it actually published to a web server when you preview it in order to accurately see what your website is going to look like. But I did mention that there were some tools including Adobe Browser Lab that simulated browsers and allowed you to get some idea of the way your page was going to look um, in a particular browser. I also mentioned that um, most of these tools um, were not very good and that included Adobe Browser Lab. And apparently Adobe um, agreed with um, a lot of people that were saying that Browser Lab just was not good enough to be used because when you go to preview now you will get a page that says that Browser Lab is shutting down on March 13th 2013 which is probably after the date you're actually um, watching this video on. So Adobe has actually closed down their Browser Lab service um, because it just was not um, um, accurate enough. They give some recommendations here um, for some alternate services that will allow you to preview um, your website. Um, but again, ultimately, you really, really need to preview your pages in the different browsers that people are going to be using. You know, open up your page in Internet Explorer and look at it in different versions of Internet Explorer. Um, Firefox, Chrome, Safari, Opera, um, and do it also, again, when it's been actually published to a web server. And there really is, it's time consuming to do, but there really is no substitute um, for um, um, actually previewing your site. So um, if you um, have been a Browser Lab user, um, it's no longer going to be available. Um, and you should begin looking for alternatives and again um, actually looking at your pages in the actual browsers is really the best way to um, go about doing that. If you want to find out um, or get more updates about tools like Browser Lab or other web design um, tools, um, there's a couple different ways that I post updates. If you go to my uh, Facebook page at facebook.com slash timothywebdesign or if you go to my Twitter feed at twitter.com slash create the net or if you go to both of them. Um, this is where I post updates um, and different resources and um, 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 tutorials and things that are of interest to people who design websites. And I do the exact same thing on um, my Twitter feed. Um, sometimes I post different resources to different pages, but oftentimes they're the same resource. So those are two great resources for um, getting up-to-date um, information. In the next video, we're going to go ahead and continue um, some setting up this banner slider. So I will see you in the next video.